Good morning, everybody. So, you know, daily routine. Tommy's ready to go out for a walk early on a Sunday morning. And Wadlow is late as always. So, Wadlow is also ready to go out for a walk on Sunday morning. Mm, we're 20 minutes late though, aren't we? Hi, Hi guys. guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. Hope you're all doing well. Today's vlog is going to be a cosy, chilled, a bit like a bit of an at home vlog really isn't at, it we've got a bit at of at home you know i don't know i'm doing this with my hair but let's put that down there we are going to start the day by going for a nice long it's walk, very early aren't we and we're just going to go for a nice nice long walk nice walk so bright and looks beautiful outside it looks like a really like autumn cold day but the sun's shining which we like don't we we like and then we've just got a few bits we want to do around the house we're also going to try to bake gingerbread men which i've never done in my life but i love them so we're going to give that a go mm. so if you are excited for this video then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and let's cue the montage out. gingerbread men i've never actually made gingerbread men ever but for those of you that know me now you will know that i'm obsessed with gingerbread men like when i went to the garden center i love to see the little gingerbread men things i love the scent i love the taste i love everything to do with gingerbread men when i was doing my food truck the other day on after there was like a halloween section so i clicked on it and it said halloween baking and i was like oh let's have a look at this and they had a gingerbread section and then you clicked on it and it said add the recipe to your basket and it just added everything in so i thought we'll give that a little go today are you ready to do some baking oh do you know what i just can't wait to do some baking i've just thought of something go we on. don't have gingerbread shaped thingies do we cutters <sighs> anything come on it's so all this time you've been telling me about gingerbread men you haven't even bought the cutters no I bought the ingredients. We're making gingerbread square. Oh, why don't we use... Why don't we make gingerbread mi Mickeys? Alright, gingerbread Mickeys. They're the only cuts I've got, so... Looks like I'm making gingerbread Mickeys. Oh. Gingerbread bites, because they're tiny. Oh, I forgot that. I, thought, I honestly thought you, you would have had that sorted. So let me get Asda up. So this is the bit that I clicked on on Asda Halloween, and then it was this baking section. And then when you clicked on that, it was these gingerbread men skeletons. But how is that going to look like that? And I'm really annoyed because we don't have the gingerbread men cut. How's it going to look <sighs> like Mickey Mouse skeletons? We'll just have to like put it out and cut it round like a gingerbread shape with a knife. I'm yeah. all over that. That's right. my job. All right. Right. Are you ready then? 80 minutes. What? One hour 20 minutes cook time. You're joking me. What? You're joking. Right, anyway. Well then, how do you do it? Details, details, details. Preheat the oven to 190. Preheat the oven to 190. Oh, by the way, actually, guys, whilst we're waiting for that, um, we went to the cinema last night. What film did we go see? What was it called? I don't know. It was something like the honest... Oh, the honest bank robber. The, yeah, something like that. It, was, it had Liam Neeson in that's the reason we went to see it. And oh my god, it was absolutely amazing. It was quite good. Actually. Definitely Even recommend I liked to go it. see it. It was really any film with Liam Neeson is good though, isn't it? So. They're all the same film. It was, it was very much like Taken, but it was. You know, really Taken good. 3 where like 
his wife, he gets framed for killing his wife. Yeah, well, that was literally the film I watched last night. Instead, it was, it was he got framed for killing a police officer. Right. So I've got a bit of a dilemma. Spoiler alert. Bit of a dilemma. Oh, what have I forgot now? Line two baking trays with baking paper. No baking tray. No baking paper. But we can grease We're them. We're so prepared. We're going to grease them with butter. Well, yeah, we'll do that. Ginger and cinnamon. Right. Oh. <laughs> As you can see, we're not professional bakers. I am. I've got a sifter. <laughs> well, we're winning. <laughs> right. That's that's pretty greased. Yeah. I'm taking that. It says sift the first five ingredients into the bowl, and the first five ingredients are oh sugar lumps. For me. Oh, I think the batteries in our scales have gone. Oh, it's up for BRB, I'm going to go to the shop, I'm going to get some batteries and whilst I'm in there I'll see if they have any gingerbread cutters but I doubt they will in Tesco. What do you? Mm -hmm. I'll have a look though, so BRB. So, got the batteries. However, they didn't have gingerbread men cutters, all they had was cookie cutters. So I bought them, so I thought we could just maybe make gingerbread cookies. It didn't have to be like men, you know what I mean? Yeah? Right. So, let's swap the battery. You have fun there, hun, I'll struggle. Five in a row. Yeah! We're on! Woohoo! Right. So, Tom, do you want to do this? Can I do a bit? Yeah, what do I do? Right, so we need 350. Oh, that's going to go everywhere, isn't it? 350 grams, I think. Let me just check. You just say to sieve it together through that. Right, well, let's sieve. Let's do it properly. Yeah, 350. Tom. Don't mean to do the power and you do the sitting. Yeah. <laughs> like sitting for gold. Put them all in. Alright. So next, hang on. So that was plain flour. One level teaspoon of bi bicarbonate. Bicarbonated soda. Yeah, so next is one level teaspoon of bicarbonated soda. Two level teaspoons of ground vinegar. Uh, not vinegar. What? Ginger. Ginger. Vinegar. Ginger. Uh, Half a level teaspoon of ground cinnamon. Then half a level teaspoon of mixed spice. 125 gram of butter chilled. 25 grams. Are you supposed to put it into the little squares? Yeah, that's what it said. A lot more. Yeah, Obviously a lot more than that. Cut the butter into small cubes and rub it into the flour until it resembles bread. So now basically we need to be going to add, Tom. Right. Do you want to do that? Because you don't want to get your hands dirty. <laughs> no. I just think you'd be really good at that, actually. Really? Until it resembles breadcrumbs. How are we looking for breadcrumbs, yeah? We're feeling that? Right, so now it says, add the sugar golden syrup and an egg to make stiff dough. Didn't pour out. How much? 175 grams. Oh, that's a lot. Where? Oh. 175. Sorry, it went to 100 then. You guys saw that on the camera. It did. We're a bit under, but that's fine. We're only one gram, that'll do. Right, and then it says to add four tablespoons of golden syrup. Because that ain't going to come off there nicely, is it? <laughs> do this. Mm, yeah, a lot of calories in I know, this. do you know, I was just thinking that. Right, and then... I'm just going to give it a... Mix in. A little squirt just for anything that was left on the yeah, spoon. Yeah, good, good thinking. You know yeah. One medium egg lightly beaten. What does that mean? Oh, right, so we do it into a jug and then beat it. Right, okay. <laughs> this is disgusting. 
Right, so now. Right, so now I think just give it a good mix, eh? Good mix? A good mix. Whoa, you can't do it with a nice. With eat. a whisk, alright, fine then. Go for it. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah, I did it with a spoon. Oh, let's do it with a spoon then. You have a go. Oh, okay, because you've realised it's hard now. Gotta be like Joe, it says. I'll do the filming, you see? It can be now like a, like a bake off. Oh yeah, Great British Bake Off. Who's been watching that by the way? Anyone been watching Great British Bake Off? We have. We love it. Been loving it. Who's your favourite in the comments below? And what was your favourite week so far? Mine was, I think I really liked it when they made them um, cakes. You know, like people that inspire them. Oh yeah. Can I get my hands in there, do you reckon? Just, Ellie, just get in there and get dirty. Oh yeah. What? <laughs> what was that? It's not going to go, is it? Tommy, do you know what? For once in our life, I think we might go up here. Oh, don't jinx that, Wadlow. Barry. Do you want me to have a Barry, we ain't got ginger and cutters. Yeah, you can have a that one. Again, with the, you've just got a nicely caress. Got a nicely caress your, your mixture. Um, I'm learning it all off the bake off again. You know, <laughs> you've just got to be really, Ginger. <laughs> like what I did there? I think that was looking really good. It is, isn't it? Look, yes. I've like cleaned the bowl. I, again, I'm learning all my tricks from Bake Off, but you've got to clean the bowl of all of it. And that's what I've done. Right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to lay the dough on the tray and then we're going to just cut it out with some of these and make some nice cookies. Or we could just make one gigantic ball. How long do they actually Ginger go in the ball. oven for as well? Right, it so feels these, good. <laughs> these go in the oven. Oh, I don't even. Where does it say? Cook time, one hour, 20 minutes. What? Right, go on then. Right. Let's lay it on that tray. No rolling pin? No problem. <laughs> we'll show you how it's done. No, maybe don't do that. Perfect. No, it's not perfect yet. We need to get it nicely all the same, you know. By the way, we have washed our hands. I'm just gonna be me and you eating them, really. I could mold some. Right. Thing. Do, we, do we want them that big or should we use the blue, this blue one? Use the blue oh, one, but... Is that... You have the little air one. Oh, I might do a few little mini Mickeys because that might be quite yeah, cute. Yeah, that's cool. you got to go You got to go right in the corner because then we can utilise them. Alright, we'll do most, them ones first and we'll use this one after, the yeah? The most of the mixture. Now, for my gingerbread man. Experimentation. This is, this is where I'm going with this spare mixture. I'm going to make a, a gingerbread man. Do you want a picture? Head. <laughs> Look, there you go. Is that what I'm working with? Yeah. Right, okay, where's the small Oh, picture? there you go, yeah, for the head. Good thinking. I was on it. Nice flat workspace. Right, heads this in. This is what we're going for. Heads in, I need the picture else. Right, heads in. From his head in there, we go back out and we do some arms. Tommy, don't need to be that big, babe. Yeah, one big one. Phenomenal. Da, 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 da. Shall I have Phenomenal. a bedroom or no? Da, 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 da. 
Hey, no, no, no. No, 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 Okay, so this is the end result. I'm just doing a bit of tip. That's mine, look absolutely atrocious. Tommy. Just drawing a six pack on mine. Just drawing a six pack. And some muscles, get some muscles in. Right, this oven's been on for an hour, Tom, with nothing in it, so come on, we need to put them in. Oh, Put them in the oven. Spooky, scary skeleton. They both go side by side, them trays. Yeah, but we want the gingerbread man to do most of the baking. It'll take the longest, I would imagine. So that's it for one hour, 20 minutes. See you in one hour, 20 minutes. Okay, so whilst we're waiting for our gingerbread men to cook, please ignore my hair, I'm gonna try and sort out this mess. Now, I sorted out ages ago, but, but you know when you sort your wardrobe out and you think, oh, okay, yeah, I haven't worn that in, six months but I know I will wear it I'm not gonna be like that today I need to be brutal if I've not worn it and I know I'm not gonna wear it it needs to go in the bin no not in the bin that was the wrong thing it needs to go to charity or some of my family who might want it or if it's like really had it then it needs to go in the bin um so that's what I'm gonna spend the rest of my afternoon doing so I just thought, bring you lot guys along with me. Have a really good sort out and like I say, I just need to do something about it because none of my clothes fit. I don't know where anything is and I know that I'll feel so much better. You know what it's like when you absolutely dread doing it? That's how I feel right now. Like I really, really, really do not want to do it. But I know it's going to make me feel better. So I need to just get on with it. See, this is where it all starts to go downhill. I love this jumper, however, it has got like bleach stains on it, so I know that I need to get rid of it. Usually, I would keep onto it, but I'm not. It's gonna go. So you think you were right? Mm -hmm. Bring it on, bring it on, prove me wrong. Go put up a fight. Mm -hmm. The way I do, way I do will knock you down. I was just sat down there playing my Xbox and my headset on so I couldn't really hear anything around. And I could smell like <laughs> burning almost but not quite burning. I thought, that doesn't smell right. So I came to check these. They've only been in, what, half an hour? Yeah. I don't understand, like what? I'm really actually annoyed. Do you know what as well? We, I had, basically they're all over, overlapping each other so I had to take a few of them out about 10 minutes ago. And we tried a little bit and it tasted amazing and we should have just took them out then. But, honestly, right? I'm really upset. I'm really excited to be The worst thing is, that's the good side. That's the black side. I do not... Our cooker didn't go to 300 at the end of the day. Tommy. No. Look. There's the recipe. One hour. Worst thing is, minutes. That, look, that, yeah, that time. I, I believe that because that is actually quite soft and it's just a fr I bet it's Do you a know what? Our cook has been doing something lately and we don't know why it's doing it, but you can put it to 180 and then after so long it just puts itself to 300, doesn't it? Yeah. And just have to turn them over. I wonder if our cooker has put itself to 300 again. Maybe. Well, if we do that... And these ones don't look 
Too bad. You know what? Them ones do. Uh, them ones uh, do. Uh, Not uh, nice. All you can taste is them. Oh, for God's sake. When it, it comes. It's really, really well at that as well. Like, I actually thought that was going to be one of these ones that was going to really work for us. So did I, actually. I'm going to blame the cooker because you've all seen it said one hour, 20 minutes. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll go with it. We did everything right. Yeah. Our cooker basically put it when you put it on it goes to 300 and then we just turn it down to whatever we want and then after so long it just goes up doesn't it to 300 again oh. i reckon the cooker yeah we'll give it another go in a few weeks and fingers crossed it works then so yeah back to the doing my wardrobe tom please will you change back that pot because i keep thinking it's quite fun <sighs> finished one thing i do need to do is get all matching hangers because that really irritates me but it looks a lot better now i know it still probably looks messy to some people but i've got rid of so much stuff all's just come round this is my pile to give away chuck away whatever really tommy's now just decided to start sorting his out and that's his pile so far is that your pile of giveaway there no oh <laughs> <laughs> That's not quite a good one. <laughs> um, and this is my pile. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to sort through it all. Sort what I want to give to family, and then what just needs to go in the bin, and what needs to go to the clothing bank. We are just on our way to pick up a Domino's for tea, which I'm so excited about you. Yes. Domino's for us, it's about 20 minutes away to get it. So we thought what we'd do is we're going to go collect it and then we're going to go sit on the beach and eat it. We like to do this, don't we? Like, yeah, not sit actually on the beach. No, in the car. In there. Um, but yeah, sit, sit in, in the, the car. car and just look and at watch, the beach. Watch the, watch the waves. Watch the world go by and watch eat the our world pizza. go by and eat pizza. So yeah, we're just on our way to get that now. Here she is. Oh, so excited. Here she is. I've got some beach. strippers as well. So just before we start eating the pizza, let me just show you our view now. We're not actually on the beach, but we found this other spot. We found it. Scarborough Castle. There's the castle. And this bad boy of a view. But that view is better. Yeah, let's show you what we've got. So Tom, oh, I always get that one, it's the meat or Meat mm -hmm. or pizza. And then Tommy always gets a pepperoni with added sausage. Yeah. So, I'm going to enjoy my pizza. Yeah, we're going to enjoy our pizza. I think we're going to go ahead and end the vlog there. Might as well, be rude yeah. not to. So thank you so much for watching today's vlog. If you did enjoy it, then don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you are returning subscribe, then thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new to the channel, then don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notification bell so you never miss a video. And um, we'll see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.